<laughs> Thanks, Custard. <laughs> Ooh, what a crowd. <laughs> Hot cross buns! Crab apple jam wants... Olali Berry Crisps for a VIP party I'm throwing. I reckon you're the perfect baker to do it. Thank you. I'm a bit particular, though. Citrus Island's lemon, brown sugar from Brown Sugar Beach, and Olali Berries might be out of season. It's just, today's pretty busy, and to get the ingredients, I'll have to close my truck and... Oh, you can't close the truck. I forgot how inexperienced you are. If it's too much, I'll ask some berry no, 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 no. I can do it all. Oh, lovely. I need it in two hours. The twins can supervise. Twins? <gasps> Holy donuts! I'm on it. We will watch. With both eyes. Who can I trust to shop so I can keep the truck open? Huck is making deliveries for raspberry. Orange is busy. Blueberry is blueberry. Hmm, who could I? Hey, maybe you can do it, Custard. Mm -hmm. Amazing, you're a lifesaver. Citrus Island's lemon? No problem. Oh, darn tablet. <laughs> Citrus Island's lemon on the house. A lot of brown sugar, though. Sorbet company for me. Yeah. <laughs> One yum for two, lady, Mr. Sing. Here you are, custard. I got your lolly berries right here. If you got the right moves. I can't believe a cat beat me. <laughs> Tell Strawberry we say hi. It's really my fault, I guess. Expected too much. Just of... in time. I hope you like it. It looks just peachy. I thought she never left. She didn't. Well then, where did all those ingredients come from? <laughs> Mika. Amazing news! The Big Apple City Museum of Natural History is hosting a seminar tonight on the various strands of rock candy native to the Stone Fruit Mountains. A seminar on rocks? That sounds... Fascinating! I was hoping I could spend an evening of educational rocking and rolling with my little limestone. That would magma day. <laughs> <laughs> See you tonight! It's pretty adorable how much you and your papa have in common. Hello, my dearest daughter. I have the most stupendous news. Coco Lachelle is showing her new fashion collection tonight, and I have two tickets. As I'm quite chiffoned of you, I was hoping we could attend together. Uh-huh. See you tonight. Fine. How can you go to the rock seminar and the fashion show? Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> what am I gonna do? Papa taught me to love learning, but Dad taught me to love fashion. I love both. No matter what I do, I'm letting one of them down. 
can't make a decision. I'm really so confused. I don't like these options. Each choice means that I still lose. This or that, or those or these. Oh, I don't really know. I'm split right down the middle. Which way should I go? Any way you slice it, I miss out on something fun. Everything is ruined even before it's begun. Any way you slice it, the answer I can't see. I'm pulled in both directions, but both directions are me. I think I might go this way. No, wait, I think that's wrong. Go back and turn around now. I still can't find where I belong. Right or left, left or right or up or down. Each way is not quite right. I'm split right down the middle while both sides fight. Any way you slice it, I miss out on something fun. Everything is ruined even before it's begun. Any way you slice it, the answer I can't see. I'm pulled in both directions, but both directions are me. There's a lot of slices when you bake a cake. Delicious choices, which one to take? Oh, it doesn't matter when each one is great. So whatever it is you do. What are you doing here? I have a date with our daughter. What are you doing here? Actually, there's an exhibit at the Cuban Time Museum about the history of Big Apple City fashion. I was thinking maybe we could all go together. We can both spend the evening doing something we love. Exactly. History for you and fashion for you. No, Mika. <laughs> what we both love most is spending time as a family, both of us together with you. That is one adorable family. <laughs> you sprouts have fun. Orange, listen to your sister. Cherry Crisp is in charge. Bye, Mom. Bye, Dad. Who's ready for the most awesome slumber party ever? I'm Hiya! down. Ooh, what are we going to do? I don't know. But I'm sure it's going to be awesome. <laughs> Any ideas? Hmm. I'm gonna watch Baker's Massacre 4. Y'all can watch it with me. Unless you're too scared. Um, or don't, whatever. How scary are the Baker's Massacre movies? <laughs> so scary! Oh, don't worry, Lon. I got you. The air smells spooky tonight. I'm in. Me too. Yes, sir. I'm not scared. Let's do it. No. Wasabi, don't go in the kitchen. Don't! Uh, the Beasley Baker isn't real. I'll be right back. Amateur. Never say I'll be right back. Huh. Now if it was me, I would... Ah! Never mind. Uh, that sure was fun, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. And no Barry is scared, right? Not me. Nah. No. No. Cool. Me either. Okay. Night, berries. <laughs> Maybe the movie was a little scary, but I brought my lucky spoon in my backpack. And with my lucky spoon, I'll be safe. Mm. I just need to go get it. You won't take me, Beastly Baker! Lemon? Are you scared too? Me? Scared? No! Uh, what are you doing? Setting traps. I thought you weren't scared. I'm not now that I've set traps. 
Freaked out by the movie. Once we admitted we were all scared and took down Lemon's traps, it was way less scary and awesome. Oh, now that's adorable. <laughs> well, um, I'm just gonna go get a snack from the kitchen. <laughs> What's going on in here? Oops, forgot that one. Lemon. <laughs> It is so nice to be able to bake in peace without having to worry about the peculiar purple. Hey there, Snortflake. Huh? Hello, fellow young people. Have you checked out that totally radical new spot across the street? The peculiar purple pie works. It's like totally trending. Why hang with old school bakers when you can buy from trend makers? Check this upside down muffin. It's hashtag fire emoji. Yeah, so well, that trendy. youth seems to know what's cool. Why is every berry leaving the berry works? This is a disaster. Every berry in my office emergency meeting. On second thought, back to the courtyard. Our customers left for the pie works. And with no customers, Crab Apple Jam will be upset. And if she's upset, she'll fire me. And if she fires me, my mother. <laughs> the pie works is popular because it's trendy. So we have to be trendier. I've studied all the latest trends in market research. If we follow them, we can't fail. Wow! Are you sure? I've always just followed my gut, not trends. <laughs> and things have worked out pretty well for me in the past. The past isn't trending. The now is trending. <laughs> Scratch that. The future is trending. Okay, Truth Fairy, I don't think this is going to work. But Fred is our friend. And... Strawberries aren't trending. Smoothies are so last week. What people want now are peanut butter sculptures of celebrities with salted caramel sauce. I'm sorry, what? Pet parades are huge on Tic Taco. March! The data shows attention spans are getting shorter by the second! Every berry needs to work triple. No, quadruple speed! Not enough! We're not hitting the nostalgia trend yet! Strawberry! Where this? Are you sure? I just think we should focus on something simple. We've got to go quintuple speed now! Cuter pet parade! Add mayonnaise to the sculpture! I'm sorry, what? Faster! Cuter! Where's the nostalgia? Hey, I know you're trying really, really hard, but I think it's time you listen to your gut. Classic looks are out. Robots are in. Bring me the cake potato! A robot? Really? Ah! <laughs> How could the data be wrong? 
What's that? That is my very, very oven. Earlier, I asked my gut what today needed. And the answer? Sugar cookie twists. Sugar cookies aren't trending. Sugar cookies never trend. Are those sugar cookies? Mm. Mm. Sometimes to find the best treat for your gut, you've got to trust your gut. Come on back! I wrote a rap about how awesome the pie works is. I'm Peculiar P, and I'm here to say, eating purple treats is the coolest way to be cool. Um, uh, boom, boom, boom. <laughs> you know, some berries are just too focused on trends. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Welcome to my basement. Are you ready for the most epic, out of control slumber party you've ever slumbered? Honestly, your brains might melt. Lemon is very excited about her first big slumber party. <laughs> it's really cute. Nothing can go wrong tonight. Everything has to be perfect. Lemon says, do your very besties want some pizza bagels, chicken taquitos, jalapeno poppers? Dad, the Berry Works Best Baker don't want your frozen appetizers. I like pizza bagels. <sighs> Sorry about that. Nothing can prepare you for the night that lies ahead. Behold, the Slumber Party 99,537! Yes! They love it! <laughs> Supposed to be doing that? Okay, yeah, that's a no then. I've got this. Hold on. Ow! Whoa. Where's that? Ow. Give me one. Oh, no. oh! You berries okay? That was a bigger explosion than we usually get. We're fine, Dad. I'll have the lights back on and Oh, the power's out across the entire city this time, kiddo. Guess we're <laughs> powerless to stop it. Seriously, Dad? You know, I used to throw some pretty epic slumber parties. I have a party finder with an entire chapter of games to play in the dark. Or if your vibe is... Our vibe is no dad's. Please. Vibe noted. This dad is here if you need him. Don't worry, I can fix this. We can still have fun. Lemon, none of us are worried. A game of human pretzel with the lend a hand 5,000? Wrestling with the Hugmeister 3,000? No, they need power. How about Blanket Fort 33,000? We can construct a multi level blanket maze. No power needed! Okay, power is better. I can get this to work on batteries. I just need like 10,433 AA's. Maybe we leave the slumber party 9,011 something alone? Oh, you can all go home if you want to. What? Why would we want to go home? I don't know. Because my dad is embarrassing, my machine is destroyed, and I've basically ruined slumber parties for all time and existence. <laughs> Lemon, none of that stuff matters. We're here because we like you. You don't need to impress us. We're gonna have fun together no matter what we do. Really? Totally! Besides, we kind of expect explosions at this point. And all the power in the city, I mean, that's impressive. Huh, it is, isn't it? So what should we do? You have any ideas? No, but I know some Barry who wants tonight to go as well as you do. Dad! Uh, my friends and I were wondering if... I have the perfect game! My slumber party turned out perfect. Because my friends like me for me. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> You're it, Blueberry! Oh, got me! Flashlight tag is awesome! Oh, hey, power's back! Now we can do the other stuff you wanted. Nah, we're already having fun. <laughs> Strawberry buttercream, citrus caramel crunch, huckle blueberry mousseline, raspberry gelée, and two, two berries, berries on top. I can't 
believe Crab Apple Jam is throwing Ben Offie's birthday bash right here in the greenhouse. I can't believe she asked us to make the cake. Is it too big? Crab Apple Jam said the bigger the better. What is she up to? What's the catch? No catch. Just good, honest baking. And Benafi's gonna love it! Oh, no, if she never sees it! Where did you two come from? The Cumin Time Museum, where Benafi's birthday party is. Didn't you hear it's moved? No! Oh, however will you get such a big cake there in the next 20 minutes? <laughs> <laughs> And there's the catch. Don't you worry. Strawberry shortcake and raspberry tart know how important this is. I'm sure they won't let you down. Where are they? I cannot believe she moved the party and didn't sue us. Bus complaining. More pushing. We have less than 20 minutes. fast as a herd of turtles. But what exactly did you deliver? <laughs> this? Well, <clears throat> uh, this is... Um, so it's... Special a... delivery for Banabi! <gasps> oh, we figured you would appreciate a dramatic entrance. <laughs> After all... For Banafi, it's all about the presentation. <laughs> it wasn't hard to figure out what happened. They left layers of cake all over the city. Seems like you can accomplish anything you set your mind to. <laughs> when you have good friends, everything is a piece of cake. Hey, shortcakes! You're really looking great out there! Awesome job! Woo! Getting better at being amazing is hungry work. Snack time? Great idea! Every berry to the spicy pizza stand! Uh, spicy? Pizza? <laughs> oh, yeah! Um, so, just how spicy is this pizza? It's like tasting lava! It'll melt your pizza! Oh, okay. I'll just ask for non-spicy. <gasps> Do not! Ask for any changes. Spicy Crust only sells spicy pizza. What? Psh. All any chef or baker wants is to make their customers happy. <laughs> Just follow our lead. Ah! One slice of spicy pizza, please. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Cannot do that. How you doing, Mr. Spicy Crust? <laughs> yeah, love what 
you got going on here? The way every berry orders one slice of spicy pizza. Mm. Really cool, cool, cool. Any berry ever mix it up and order one spice of slicey pizza? Because <laughs> you know that would be total air, am I right or what? <laughs> I can see you're busy. I'll take a slice of pizza. You know, not spicy. Mm, my name is Spicy Crust. This is the spicy pizza stand. No spice, no pizza for you! <laughs> We tried to warn you, shortcakes. Let me try to get you a slice. One slice of spicy pizza, please. You already had a piece today. Th this is uh, uh, for my friend. She she was just trying to. No pizza for you! I wrote a song about the power of forgiveness. Love. No pizza for you! The universe told me you would be much happier mm. if you hurried right, then. We'll give you this lend a hand 5,000 for an extra slice of pizza. It could help you toss pizza dough. No pizza for you! You are your robot! Good day. I'm Beef Wellington, Strawberry's uncle. Please give her another opportunity mm. for some pizza! No pizza for any of you! Treat your customers this way. If somebody doesn't want sprinkles on their cupcake, you know what I do? I don't put sprinkles on it. Because it makes berries happy. No pizza's good enough for you to go around scaring every berry. <laughs> Spicy pizza's all I know how to make. <laughs> oh, look, there's nothing to cry about. All you need is to find some berry who can show you how to make other kinds of pizza. But I've been so mean. Who would do that for me? I made a veggie pizza. <laughs> and it's not spicy. You did. I knew you had it in you. I can make all kinds of pizza now. Oh, ho, ho. Thank you, Strawberry. But, uh, my spicy pizza is still my specialty. It would mean a lot if, uh, you'd give it a try. I, um, well, okay. So you like it? Oh, <laughs> yes. So good. <laughs> <laughs>